We are setting up the four-color KCM kit on the artillery sidewinder. First, disconnect the filament sensor connector and remove the stock filament holder. Next, unscrew the print head cable and disconnect it from the printer. Take off the screw securing the print head cover then remove both the cover and the fan cable. Continue by detaching the extruder motor and unplugging all connectors. The calibration sensor should also be removed followed by the light. After that, take out the print headboard. To make removing the spacer easier, loosen the belt, then unscrew and detach the spacer itself. Now, it's time to install the chroma head mounting part. Once positioned, secure it to the rail-mounted piece with a screw and tighten everything firmly. Retension the belt. Insert the square nuts into the designated slot. Unbox the chroma head and prepare it for installation. Remove the front cover, disconnect the fan cable and secure the head in place. Tighten the remaining screws then attach the 8-in-1 module. Reconnect the print head cable fastening it securely and reattach the fan cable along with the front cover. Next, take out the extruders. To install the mounting part, First remove the motor. Carefully align everything and tighten the screws. Insert the T-nuts into the mounting part to secure it to the Sigma profile. Once in place, mount the extruders onto the printer and start connecting the motor cables. Unbox the KCM and connect the motor cables, ensuring the correct sequence. Plug in the Type-C cable. Move the print head to its farthest position for easier PTFE tube installation. Cut the tubes to the correct length and install them.
bundling them together with the print head cable. Now, connect the KCM power cable followed by the print head cable. Plug in the printer's power cable and turn it on. Attach the USB hub to the printer and connect the KCM cable to it. Retrieve the printer's IP address and enter it in the browser to access Mainsail. In the machine section, delete the printer.cfg file, backing it up if necessary. Upload the new configuration files and restart the firmware. Open kcm.cfg, go to Devices and Refresh. Copy the new path, paste it into the Serial section and save before restarting. Next, open chromahead.cfg and immediately connect the print head cable to the printer. In Devices, restart once more. Update the serial section with the new path Then save and restart to complete the setup. Open Orca Slicer and load the model. Apply the necessary paint Adjust the bed dimensions and set the number of models. Once everything is ready, start the print. This test print, done on the KCM equipped Sidewinder X4 Plus, took 3 hours and 50 minutes to complete. Thank you for watching.